Here's what happens if Trump can't get a $464 million bond, editors note. A New York appeals court on Monday reduced the required bond amount to $175 million and gave former President Donald Trump 10 more days to post bond to satisfy the civil fraud judgment. Donald Trump's legal team and the New York Attorney General's office are working hard ahead of the former president's Monday's deadline to secure a bond for the multi-million dollar civil fraud judgment against him, Trump personally owes over $454 million stemming from the ruling made by Judge Arthur Engeron back in February. The figure balloons up to $463.9 million when including the money owed from his sons, Eric and Donald Jr. The Trump Organization and the interest that was accrued as of the date of the ruling, experts who spoke to CNN say Attorney General Letitia James and her staff should be poised to start the complicated legal maze of seizing Trump's assets if the former president does not secure the bonds needed to cover Engeron's ruling as he appeals.